Welcome back everyone to another Fast Meal Prep Hack. So in today's episode, I'm going to create a fast and easy vegan egg roll bowl. So let's go ahead and start. So when it comes to this meal, we only need four easy ingredients. So the first one will be our coleslaw mix, okay? Tons of different vegetables when it comes to green and purple cabbage with some carrots in there. Very high in vitamin A and also C, which is great for our immune system. Light, light, smart ground crumbles. 100% plant-based, very high in protein, moderate in carbs, and also very low in fat. Soyaki sauce from Trader Joe's, okay. This is uh, like a teriyaki sauce that has some garlic in there, just egg. This is a uh, alternative meat that you can use when it comes to eggs. It's really, really good. So let me grab this new bottle actually, all right? So let's go ahead, get our ingredients ready. So first thing we're gonna do is grab our pans. So we need two pans for this particular dish. So I have my iron skillet and a um, non-stick skillet as well. I'm gonna put both on medium heat. All right, start off like that. Now, the next thing we're going to do is go ahead and prep. So what I'm gonna do is go ahead and open this up, open up our veggies. All right, before, actually, before we even start cooking, let's wash our hands, all right? Definitely need to do that. Back to the cooking. So first thing I'm going to do is grab some olive oil spray, all right? Put this in the iron and also the nonstick skillet. Then we're going to grab our coleslaw and go ahead and put the whole bag in there, okay? We're going to stir fry the cabbage, all right? So while that's cooking, we're just gonna keep that there while everything warms up, all right? Now, the next thing we're gonna do is grab our vegan egg, all right? And we're gonna use half a bottle of this. So half a bottle is equivalent to six tablespoons, okay? We're just gonna go ahead and pour half of that in there. Now, when it comes to our coleslaw, you can hear it crackling, okay? So when we're doing this, you wanna kinda of continuously stir it, all right, and flip everything over, because you don't want the coleslaw to overcook. What I like to do is just keep stir frying it, and then once it gets to like halfway cooked, halfway not cooked, that's when I remove it from the skillet, okay? But you wanna really pay attention while you're cooking this, because you don't want it overcooked, okay? It's gonna to be too soggy. And, and I'm not a type of person that likes soggy veggies when it comes to this particular dish. All right, so right now, as you can see, if you see the dish like this, I want it just like this. It's half cooked, half raw still, okay? This is very fast. So I'm gonna go ahead and pull out my plate, and I wanna go ahead and start putting this out. Right. Just like that. With this particular dish, you, with the salad, you don't want to keep it on the, on the pan because it's just going to keep cooking, okay? You really want to take that out extremely fast. Now, this is off. Now we're going to go ahead and move to the next. So we're looking at our egg, all right, our vegan egg. I'm gonna go ahead and start making this into a scramble, okay? And as you can see, I'm not using any other ingredients really, it's just these four. So as you see, I'm putting everything to the side and there's a reason. So now the next thing I'm gonna do, the next thing I'm gonna do is go ahead and open this up, all right? Get our meatless crumbles from Light Life. I'm gonna go ahead and put this into the, on the side. And as you see, I'm like kind of crushing it together. So it being into a crumble right on the side. 
and then I'm going to cook both of it in the same pan and then end up mixing it together. You kind of don't want to mix it together real fast. You want to kind of wait till this, till the vegan egg kind of cooks a little bit. Then you can start mixing it. All right. If you do it too early, it's not going to like be like an egg egg. You know, it's kind of just going to get with the meat. So what I like to do is see as it turns into a scramble, and like an actual vegan, like well, like an actual egg scramble egg. Right. Now I start mixing it. But turn on the heat a little bit more, just like that. Really easy and simple dish. It's something fun that you can do while you're at home throughout this pandemic. All right. And the best thing about this dish is that next thing, and the best thing about this dish is that it's super fast and easy. It takes literally 10 minutes to cook. It's really nothing to it. Okay. Now, some of the best things about this dish is that it's filled with tons of micronutrients and fiber. This is the things that's gonna really help with your immune system, make it nice and strong. So not that it's just, not that it's just um, an easy and fast dish to make, but it's something that's gonna really help boost up that immune system, okay? And this is really important during these times. All right, y'all, so everything is done. So we're gonna go ahead and place this on top, okay? Just like that. And the thing about this dish is that if you're like a big guy like me, you can eat it the whole thing or you can split it up into two or three servings, okay? So the last thing we're gonna do is we're gonna take the soyaki sauce, just get one tablespoon, that's all you really need. If you need two, you can use two, that's all right. And pour it right on top, all right? And then what I like to do is go ahead and kind of mix it up. Just like that. And the reason I call it egg roll bowl because this is how your egg roll will look like except without that fried bread, okay? And that's it, all right? So it's pretty easy, it's pretty fast to make, very high in protein. I'm gonna have all the macronutrients in the description box, but with that said, that's my fast and easy immune boosting vegan egg roll bowl. If you like this video, Please uh, comment, like, share with your friends. I would, I would truly appreciate it. But with that said, my name is Corinne Sutton, and I'll speak to you soon. Peace.